Good afternoon folks, Ken Boyd with Brimstone Firearm Instruction and today we're going to talk about trigger control. If you've been following the series, we've talked about hold control with your grip and stance. We've talked about aiming with your sight picture and sight alignment. Now we've talked about breath control. Now we're talking about trigger control. Trigger control is one of the most important things about the fundamentals. The last fundamental is follow through and we'll talk about that in our next video. Grip and trigger control are probably the two greatest uh, effects you have on, on your marksmanship. So we've already talked about grip, let's talk about trigger control. Trigger control is you've stopped breathing, you've got your proper sight alignment, everything is as stable as possible. Now the last action you're gonna work with that pistol before the, the, the bullet goes down the barrel is the trigger, and that could also throw your sights off. So what you wanna do is you wanna form your finger so you got the tip of your finger here, middle section, big section. So I'm gonna exaggerate that by making this the tip of the finger, your middle section, and the back section. So what you wanna do is you wanna come out, trigger right here. You want the, the middle or the meaty part of your tip of your finger right on the trigger, and you want it to come straight back like this. If you're gonna use your tip, what's happening is you're gonna push it off to the left or right if you're left-handed. And if you want to wrap your finger too much on your trigger finger, you pull it down, you're going to pull it to the right if you're right-handed or left if you're left-handed. So i got a handy stick right here. So what we want to do is we want to move, use your trigger finger to move this straight back. And so what you want to do is you put the meaty part or the middle part of the tip of your finger coming in, and you want to move it straight back, just like that. See how it's coming straight back? Good, that's good trigger pull. Now, if you wanna use the tip of your finger like this, what's gonna happen is you're gonna to tend to wanna to pull it off to the left like that. Or, if you're left-handed, it's gonna go off to, the, off to the right. You wanna avoid that. Now, if you use too much trigger finger and you get your knuckle on there, what's gonna happen is you're gonna pull it, if you're right-handed, you're gonna pull your front sight post off to the right and your shot group is gonna land to the right. Same way as opposite direction with the left hand. It's gonna to go to the left. So what you wanna do is you want, I don't care if you call it a trigger squeeze, a trigger pull, or a trigger press. You want the trigger to come straight back every time, just like this.